by God's blessing, he is enabled to have opportunities to share the message of Jesus and to perform by the power of God miracles of truth. God bless us to be to the so many, many people from the church that Peter and John come down from Jerusalem to Samaria to a church church in the New York City. And this is Peter and John. Peter and John, who is a part of the Christian congregation, who they themselves were persecuted, they were put in jail because they had healed somebody in the name of Jesus. They were talking to people about Jesus. And they were brought out of jail and made the same court, same court that condemned Jesus to death before Christ and before Caiaphas and all the rest. And they were told, you better choose to this. We don't have a right to hear you mention the name of Jesus again. And they were concerned. 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 They were So the Lord said to Philip, go south to the road, the desert road, that goes down from Jerusalem to Gaza. And Philip started out and on his way to met an Ethiopian eunuch, and fortunes of the church, tried to all the territory of the Pentecost, which means king of Ethiopia. This means he's gone to Jerusalem to worship, and on his way home, was sitting in his chariot, reading the book of the day of the prophet. The Spirit told Philip, go to the church. Of 
went to work. I did very quickly to the world. So he very happy with the book of my career for time. What the message that we need to send to the people who do need to do it. And what does that tell you about? What does that tell you about? What is the purpose of this? This reading from the Bible. Jesus said by the way, he's going to worship. He's going to believe. He's one who has come to believe in the Lord God of Israel and will come to Jerusalem and will come to believe the journey across the desert to such a hundred miles. He's going to worship that time. And he wanted to know what was happening. He was a believer who had the book of Isaiah. He had the book of Isaiah. If he said it, he couldn't put it down. He wanted to know more. 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 And when you lose your home and you come to the and you do that, you just that, you lose your home and you lose all that. And you do that every Sunday, Sunday after Sunday, and you do that every Sunday. And that's all the way you do it. And you say, you have to ask, okay, oh, we're going to have to empty out and wait to stay some time for the time. And when you come into the parking lot, you come into the sanctuary, and you come to worship, and then you may say to the Bible class, you come to the sanctuary, because you want to know the Lord, and to worship the Lord. By your truth, you are not. You worship here, or whether you worship in the morning this morning, whether you're reading the Bible at home, or whether you're reading Bible studies here, or if you're in God's Word, or in the sanctuary, then Philip ran up to the chair and heard the man reading in the chair of the prophet. Do you understand what you are reading for a time? How can I do so? Let me just come and explain this to me. So he invited Philip to come up and sit with him. This is the pastor that sits for the end of the day. He is led like the sheep to the flock. And as a lamb before his hearing is silent, so he did not open his mouth. In his humiliation, he is surprised to death. Who can speak of his descendants? The Christ who is perfect for me to pray. The eunuch asked Philip, tell me, please, who is the prophet talking about, himself or someone else? And so it began with that very passage of Scripture and told him, Good news about the truth. You see, also, you want to come and 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 you want to and the Ethiopian and vice versa come up and eat food and put it up in the Bible and to explain to him what he knows as he was put to see what he has to do. And he explains to the news to the Ethiopian that this is all about the land being slaughtered and cut off from the land of the earth. This is all about Jesus. That's all about a different thing to believe. It means his son and his son to be his son. He tells him to be his son. He tells him to be his son. He tells him to be his son. The good news of the Lord. And so the Lord, through His Word, also encouraged the Lord to say, like you go and do and sit like that and say, you go and do and pay the spiritual milk of the Lord and do that about the body of the Lord and God. 
So as they traveled along the way, they came to some water, and the eunuch said, Look, here is water. What is standing in the way of my being baptized? And he gave orders, and he said, To stop the chariot. Then they forth, and the eunuch went down into the water and Philip baptized him. When they came up out of the water, the spirit of the Lord suddenly took Philip away, and the eunuch did not see him again. But when he was there, He 
comes to us through the world and he removes us by his grace and his precepts and his mercy and word and scripture. So that he says from him that the Father looks at us as if every piece of paper that we produce is just perfect for us. So if you and I to be that our Heavenly Father is to be Knowing that Jesus Christ is continuing to be Let us see the story of this, but it's continuing. 